I would never, I, I would never, never, me personally. Yay. Feel free, man. Feel free. What's up? <laughs> yeah, how you doing? Yep. Oh. <laughs> how was that? Oh, uh, yeah. Um, never again. So small in comparison to the mic. <laughs> like this is a 16 mil lens at f2.8, but yeah, the mic's just a lot bigger. It's all wrong. Yeah, it just feels wrong. It just feels super wrong to vlog with this lens, but technicality, it's more practical because it's an f2.8 lens. Granted, I don't have 35, but I, I can get it. I just I'm paying for it. This this lens here. Trying to vlog here. Like, uh, come on. You don't. What, what, what's the emergency? Come on. This is this is vlog life. <laughs> you just wait for people to pass you by so it doesn't look as awkward. That is so distracting. But it's also scary. Yeah. Again, I feel like it's just gonna come collapsing down. Cool. Hey, Thomas. Yo. I'm at like 128. Thousand eyes eye. No. Yeah, it doesn't make my skin. Twelve thousand eight hundred. Do, do I look good though? Yeah, the light is pretty good actually. That's good, that's all that matters. Yeah. Yo, what is going on guys? Hope you guys had a fantastic day. This is just way too much energy for six o'clock at night. Yeah, way too much. <laughs> and way too much energy for a Wednesday. Is it Wednesday? <laughs> it is Wednesday. It is Wednesday. It feels a bit weird because we've just had Easter. This is this Is this what I look like? Hold on, wait, wait one sec. What? Alright, so this is my first time looking at someone else use my camera to vlog, so That's right. it looks like a ma it's, yeah, it's a massive setup. Like, it's a little crazy. Look, look at this. We're looking at like 16 to 35 lens, R6 with a battery grip with the switch pod attachment and the Rode NTG. It just, it looks professional. <laughs> it That's does. all I can say. It, it, looks, it looks very professional. Yeah. And this doesn't actually feel that different to how I used to vlog because I didn't have this tripod. Um, I had the, the Joby. Joby, yeah, the Joby yeah. one. Had the Joby one, and then I stopped. And then now I hold it a lot more like that nowadays. Oh, hey, so, what's up? Hands free vlogging. That's uh, that's the only reason why Thomas is here, so I can just not give the arms a rest. That's all it is. Yeah. <laughs> How do you go with swearing in your videos? I, if you do, I, I censor it out. All right, I'm his little <laughs> today. 
<laughs> Nick, that's work. That's work, man. Come on. Hey, V Pop, do you want to go jump in the. Uh... I kind of do, actually. Yeah. Go, go, go jump in, the in there? Triangle. Yeah, go jump in the triangle. Just looking at the triangle, I'm like, ooh, photo op. Off you go, go jump in it. Hell yeah. Posing. Screenshot in three, two, one. All right, I'm gonna give this back to V-Pop because my arm's actually getting a little sore. Right, let's go get some food because I am starving. That's a professional vlog. Like, I've, I don't, I've got nothing on this. Canon EOS. Okay, so Thomas says, you know, popped off to the loo, you know, as you do, and I've decided just to sit down and talk a little bit to the camera, as, because, you know, we need the story to keep going, and I think we're going to talk about making one for yourself, right? As creatives, you can fall into a rut and just not want to create anything, and it's, it's, it's really hard when you get to that point, because you want to go out and take photos, you want to go out and make films, you want to do all these things, but you're just mentally not there, you're like, I, just, mm, I want it, but not today, not today. <laughs> it's completely normal vlogging, I swear. It's not awkward at all, not socially awkward at all. But yeah, we fall into these creative ruts sometimes, and Thomas is in one right now. I'm in a bit of a rut right now. And you know, sometimes you just gotta get out there and just do it. Nike. <laughs> Talk more in a second, but yeah, this is kind of what I wanted to base this whole vlog around. Like, you gotta go out and create one for yourself, not for other people, not for. Instagram, not for YouTube, you go out, you create it for yourself. That's all, that's all I'm saying. All right. See you guys in like, the next scene. I don't know, jump cut or something. <laughs> ah, YouTuber thing. Oh, out of focus, out of focus, out of focus. That's where we're heading. Over there. This is, uh, this is what I call the subtle vlogging technique. So. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not doing it at all. It's a great way to get like a nice up the nose shot. And the double chin. Yeah, double chin. Uh, hey dude, there's like, there's like nothing on the train. You mind if I just, if I, if I just... No, I'm not vegetarian. I just sometimes eat vegetarian food. So you're vegetarian? I just told you, I ate chicken. It's really cold. <laughs> no idea where we're going, just... You could be taking me to throw me off the balcony and take my stuff. Yes, yeah, yeah, just down this creepy alleyway. <laughs> is that the elevator or is that the stairs? Well, to the top. You wait for the elevator. Okay. Wait, what, what level? Six floor. Six floor? <laughs> right. <laughs> no. You botched it. <laughs> I'm not running up six flights of stairs. Get out. If it was like, Third floor, go! I'm like, oh, sure, third floor, it's gone. How, how, how's this for lighting, though? Um, the rooftop's gonna be the same. Pretty dark, man. Pretty, pretty dark. I mean, I can bump the ISO, but not rather not. There's a light. We're chasing the light. I'm old, all right. No. See, look, it's a nice light on my face. You know, you get the light side, you get the dark side. Nice contrast. Photography, 101 people. All the best tips, subscribe for more tips like that. We love it when the, the microphone's just not on, so, uh, and I'm, I'm, I can't be bothered to redo the whole thing, so we're just gonna go from here, guys. Yeah, too much, yeah. yeah. Hey, so uh, thanks, thanks for coming out. It's all right, thanks for catching up. It's been a while. It's been, it's been, it's been, it's been. I think it's like the first time we've ever hang, yeah. hung out. Like yeah, this. Yeah, I think we've actually, yeah. yeah.
knowing that never like I've, I've seen you around. Yeah. Um, you're always at Nathan's place. It's weird. Yeah, it's weird that I'm always at Nathan's place. What yeah. a coincidence! I also live there. Huh. <laughs> we live together. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. How's that? Is he? Is he oh yeah, he's alright. Now I love you, Nathan. <laughs> I love you. Nathan. I love you. Alright. I love you. <laughs> Yeah, a little, little bit too much. Like, I love you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so, T Thomas, I uh, I follow you on Instagram. Do you? I do. And if I you follow you back. Oh, sweet. <laughs> and if you don't follow Thomas, you should go follow him now. That's a uh, mandatory plug aside. You post like every day. I've been posting every day for the last bit over a year. That's insane. To me, that's just that's crazy. It's unheard of. And I, I don't know how you do it, but you do it. And every time I see you post, I think to myself, I'm like, should I, should I post more? Should I go out and take photos? Should I, should I do this because Thomas is doing this? If you want to do it, do it. But here's the thing, though. See, my me, like as myself, I'm very much a routine person. So, you know, my daily life stuff, I have a routine. And the same thing with posting. Because I started off doing it, and I've kept doing it, and after a year, it ends up being part of your routine, so you kind of do it without thinking. And with the amount that I go out and take photos, I have a lot of photos to post. So. It feels weird if you don't. And it feels weird. Like, there had been, I think just recently, probably about a week ago, I didn't post something, which just felt odd. Like, it's either I post a reel, or I post a photo, or. You do both? <laughs> or I do. No, I've never done both in a day. Okay. I've never done both in a day. So I that's, generally, that's how you stagnate? Yeah, I generally post like a one reel a week or one oh, yeah. reel a fortnight. Yeah. But generally I post every day. But yeah, not posting one day just felt completely weird, like wrong. But now oh, we're fixing that now, so go back posting every day. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I wanted to talk about. I shouldn't feel like I need to post every single day because, I mean, for some people it's just unrealistic. Like I have work five five days a week. I have two days off, and once those two days rock around, rock around. Who says rock around? Once yeah. those <laughs> once those two days rock around, you don't feel like doing anything. You don't feel like going out taking photos. Just don't feel like doing it then. Yeah. And I sh I, you shouldn't force yourself to do something. Because if you force yourself to do something, you're not gonna enjoy it, and it's, you're not gonna capture the best best thing you can. Like in a way. Yeah. Like if I force myself to go out now. Come on, man. <laughs> if I force myself to go out and like, make a vlog, if I force myself out to go take photos, my, like, the drive isn't gonna be there. It's gonna be a, I feel like I have to do this because of this. It should be, I wanna go out because I want to go out and take photos. I wanna go out and do a vlog. I wanna go out and make a short film because that's just what I wanna do. You shouldn't feel like, you are forced to do anything and I think that's something else social media and the internet has kind of like pushed people it's like if you're yeah. not if you're not posting on Instagram did it really happen well yeah it did happen yeah. and you may not post those photos that you took that night but it still happened and you, you shouldn't feel pressure to like create for other people you should create for yourself and if you want to share it with other people more power to you but that's that's what this video that's what this video is about because if you haven't noticed I haven't uploaded for a long time and I want to get back uh, into it. See, I'm actually trying, I'm actually waiting for that video that you did not ages ago with Nathan and us. Yeah? Where's that video? <laughs> yeah, man. Um, <laughs> like, I was waiting. I filmed with Thomas, this is not the first time I'm filming with Thomas. It's, um, it's in production, man. I, yeah. It's gonna be like my, my holy grail video. Like it's, gonna okay. be, it's gonna be a okay. nice video. Like you're okay. gonna... I, thought, I thought you were just like, oh, we'll drag you out. If it was no, like no, scratch no. the video. No. <laughs> Haven't scrapped it. It is coming, Thomas. It is coming. Okay. But time's ticking. Yeah, time's ticking, eh? <laughs> I, just, oh, I, need, I, need, I just want to get other people to come out and like, interview them. And then I've yeah. got to hire a crew. And then I've got to get the set. And then I've got to get a makeup artist. And then I've got to do all this stuff. And <laughs> so much effort. Yeah. But yeah, don't go out and create because you feel like you need to create. Go out and create because you want to create. Because creativity is not something you just turn on and off. Creativity is just something that happens and you gotta let it flow, you gotta let it like, guide you in a way. And we're gonna pause here. <laughs> Have a good night, man. Uh, yeah. I think I got my message over. 
across pretty well. I think you did. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So. Now, you anything you want to add on to that, man? Well, you kind of man. Uh, you, you went into detail fairly good with that. So yeah, don't create for other people. Create for yourself. And if you start creating for other people, and like you know, if you're up on Instagram and you're like asking what do you pick, you know, what do you want to see? You're not creating for yourself. You're creating for someone else. And as soon as you start creating for someone else, then you lose your creativity, you'll burn out, you go out and shoot, you know, you take very average photos because you're trying to please someone else. And that's just not for photography, it's for anything creative. If you're doing music, if you're doing video, if you're doing art, or painting, drawing, whatever, you know, if you're doing it for other people, you're gonna burn out. Your interest for doing that creative craft is gonna so if you create for yourself, then happy days. And here's another thing about, I actually had thought about this the other day, yeah. about the whole creating for yourself and social media, is that, now look, I, I post on Instagram every single day. No, stop blobbing it in. Huh? Stop blobbing it in. Yeah. So I post on Instagram every single day. And for me, and other people have their, their own opinion with this, for myself, I do it because I enjoy creating. I'm very much a right brain person. So it's just all creativity. So posting something, you know, it's like posting, you know, what I'm happy with. I'm just putting on social media for everyone else to see. But then that can also be the misconception of you posting every day just to try and get likes. Which is not entirely true. And again, if you're trying to post every single day um, and try to upload to social media to try and get all these likes and follows, you're also going to burn out if that's your main goal to get, like grow very quickly. Yeah. Yeah, that's not the reason why you should posting videos where you should be not the reason like in creativity you shouldn't be doing it no. for something else you should be doing it because you want to do yeah. it oh yeah <laughs> that's um that's today's video guys hope you enjoy hopefully i didn't blow that my target goal of 10 minutes we'll see yeah more we'll like see. 10 hours <laughs> <laughs> so much footage man all right anyways so yeah hope you enjoyed the video and make sure you go subscribe to him go down hit that little bell hit the like button go follow his socials he will leave them up there. They'll also leave them in the description. Don't follow me, follow me. Have you done this before? Nah, never. Never? Never before? Nah, that's a lie. Details, in the <laughs> details down below. Guys, right, thanks for coming out, man. That's all right. Yeah, I'm all good. I just. Yeah. All right, all right, I'm going now. See ya, bye. See you, man. I'm going to just sit here. I need my stuff. You might, yeah. I mean, I'll happily take it. Just... And. Uh. Ah. Anyways, see ya, V Pop. Yeah, see you, man. Oh no, don't die! Yeah, see ya! <laughs> hey, you've got the R5, I've got an R6, I, I know what I'm taking. Then get my bag open. I don't miss your phone. I need my phone! Uh. But yeah. Alright, no, guys, uh, that's it for today. Uh, have, a, have a swell one, and uh, you know, if you want to listen to the advice, go ahead. If you don't, psh, I'm not forcing you to do anything. Yeah, sure. Dude, how do you end videos? Like, I don't know. Don't, don't slap it. Don't slap it. Don't hit it. <laughs>